welcome back to my channel. So I'm not sure if you can see already, a little sneak peek over here, but this will be a Lush haul. Actually, you would have known that from the title already. I don't know what I'm talking about. Let's just get straight into it. I'm just going to show you exactly what I got and tell you how they smell. And this time I filmed the video before and I think I deleted the video, um, but basically I kept getting Lush products on my nose and it was pretty embarrassing. So I think I just deleted that whole video because I couldn't face going through the whole thing with white powder on my nose that looks quite suspicious but I promise it was a bath bomb. For me I didn't actually buy that much, usually I get about 20, 25 pounds worth and it was only like 15 pounds worth um, of bath bombs so yeah not that much for me. We usually get a lot more. But as I said in the last video I filmed I've got like lush all over my nose so I don't know if I should publish that. So this one is the Razzle Dazzle and it's a bath oil and it smells so good. It smells a bit like Snow Fairy, but a little bit like like orangey, like a warm orange to it. And the best way to describe it would be a sparkly rock, if I'm honest. Um, yeah, a sparkly pink rock, and if you hold it too long, you'll get glitter in your hands. Don't make the mistake I did in the store of sniffing it and getting glitter in your nose too. I need to stop sniffing things. That is a problem. I clearly have. So I like to keep them packaged up so they don't like crumble and get wet and go everywhere. That's just me personally, I don't know what you like to do. This is the Fresh Handmade Cosmetics, no, that is not what this is. This is the Avo Bath and I've had this before but I'm, it's like my favourite bath bomb, like ever, like ever. And I've had so many bath bombs over the years, I don't know why I don't film more of these videos because I do have a lot of baths and a lot of bath bombs, I'm not sure. Why this is the first Lush haul I am uploading because I've been going to Lush since I was about 15 and I'm now 22 when you see this video. Oh, it just smells so fresh. Um, oh, I could just sniff that all day. Probably shouldn't. I'll probably get high on Lush. But it's really good. That is my favourite. If you love like fresh, like citrusy, like fresh cut grass kind of scents, you will love the Avo Bath. It doesn't smell anything like avocado. Just putting that out there. So this is You've Been Mangoed and... It smells exactly like the Avo Bath Bath Bomb. So if you want to have a bath bomb and a bath oil in your bath at the same time, to have the mixture of the bubbles and the smooth skin, then chuck this in your bath and it will be the best bathing experience you've ever had. Again, if you like fresh citrusy scents. So I'm a really big fan of bubble bath. I prefer a bubble balm to bath bomb. But this is the first time I've ever tried the Candy Mountain bubble bath. It's not really good. Um, I usually get Granny Takes a Dip. But I thought I'd ranch out, try another one. And it looks like a little unicorn, I'm not gonna lie. That might be why I bought it. If you like snow fairy like this, it's very sweet, bubble gummy, kind of candy cane. Does it say candy cane on it actually? No, candy mountain. Candy floss, that's what it smells like, not candy cane. So yeah, if you love candy floss or sweet things, you'll like this. I'm not sure what it does in your bath, other than it's a bubble bath, so it'll make bubbles. Um, so yeah, I'm excited and I'm guessing it'll make my bath sparkly pink. So this is Granny Takes a Dip and you've probably like seen it like a million times of YouTube because it's probably quite a popular one because it's freaking amazing like oh, It smells good. I mean it doesn't look like much when you look at it. It's like meh should I get it? But I'm telling you now it's like the best thing ever ever Um, it just makes your bath so bubbly and pretty and it doesn't make it green and icky looking like this like very sweet, so yeah, if you like sweet scents, you like the bub the granny takes a dip, and when you plunge it into your bath water, it kind of makes like rings of different colours if you use the whole thing. I like to break it in half and use half of it and half at a later date because I don't want to ruin it all at the same time because <laughs> it's so good I want to use it again. And then last, but definitely not least, is my baby bot, and it's so cute and it smells like lavender, which I love. Um, and I think it's a very soothing one. It's great for before you go to bed if you have like trouble sleeping I tend to have trouble sleeping sometimes especially if I'm like cold to the bone So it's nice to have a lovely bubble bath or if you've had a stressful day at work Lavender is very relaxing. So this one's amazing And it's shaped like a robot So I feel like if you have a little baby boy and it's just, like hard getting him like to enjoy bath time I feel like if you chuck this in he like he will just want to jump into the bath to join, join the robot like I do Like who would want a bath with this little cute thing? Other than the um, Candy Mountain one, this is pretty much all stuff I've bought before, which is really bad, but I'm the kind of person that if I find something I love, I will buy it again, instead of venturing out and trying other things. Um, so hopefully next time I'll buy loads of new things to show you instead of just the same things again, because this is what I tend to repurchase every time I go to Lush, which is embarrassing, really. 
But that was it. That's my Lush haul. It's very small. I know. I'm a bit of a shopaholic, so this is probably the smallest haul I've ever done on this channel. So if you enjoyed watching my Lush haul, make sure to click the like button so I know to film more hauls in the future, or just Lush ones in particular. I do go there a lot. That can be arranged. And if you like my makeup during this video, make sure to tune in next week because next week's video is how I actually did this makeup and it's a mixture of me doing my makeup whilst updating you. So really, it's a two-in-one, so you have to go check it out. So I'll see you next week. Bye! Oh my god, the packaging. <laughs> like a bloody present at Christmas. Mm -hmm.